today I'm making Boston beans and what you'll need is a pound of navy beans or some people call them pea beans and some uh, dark molasses and you can either use four strips of bacon or I have a, I have a pork jowl that I got at my local market and two to three tablespoons of brown sugar and a half a teaspoon of salt and I soaked my pea beans overnight and I've drained the water off of them and I'm gonna put, put them in the oven and I'm gonna let them cook at 325 for six seven hours and I'll be stirring these off and on throughout the day because we don't want them to run out of liquid the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take your smoked jowl or your bacon I have a bean pot it was my mother-in-law's and when she passed away it got passed down to my husband but you can use a Dutch oven and anyway you put your bacon or your pork jowl in the bottom and then I'm going to put the pea beans on top oh that's going to be interesting right, so put your beans in your pot it fills it up and then I'm going to add the brown sugar My mother-in-law was raised in New Hampshire, so she grew up eating these baked beans, and she loved them. Loved them. All right. And a half a cup of dark molasses. Get that all in there. that up a little bit and then you're going to add just a little bit of water I'm going to start I'm going to add a cup of water and throughout the cooking process you may need to add some but remember add a little at a time because you can always add more but it's hard to take out okay I've got that all stirred up and I've added a cup and a half of water because that just does cover my beans and then I'm going to add a half a teaspoon of salt and stir that in a little bit and then I'll be ready to put it in the oven yeah. All right. then I the original lid with this got broke so this is the one that Nana always used so there's her lid so we'll check back out uh, off and on throughout the day and see how they're doing it's been my beans have been cooking for about three three and a half hours I wanted to get them out and stir them real good and my uh, pork jowl is uh, falling apart in there which is good because it's getting it all spread around out there so I'm gonna put them back in the oven and let them continue cooking for five or six more hours it's been about seven hours since we first put our beans in and as you can see they're all browning and the molasses oh they smell delicious and I'd say they're just about done now I've stirred them once or twice every hour and I've had to add a little bit of water because I don't want them to stick. They are real close to being done. That's just a big old piece of that uh, smoked jowl that fell apart during the cooking process. There we go. Smells great. It's been eight hours and now I've taken my bean pot out of my oven and there we have it Boston baked beans they smell delicious they're really good you can find this recipe and others at www.carolseasycooking.com